Hey, good morning everybody. Nice to have you back on the channel. Kind of a slow and tired morning at Groovy Psycho Works today, but I am working on a project for another company. Eleven Ants out of Holland is putting together a 29er adventure bike, and they needed a titanium fork and bar and seat post and some other little fiddly bits. So today, I thought I'd show you the fork that we're working on. It's a titanium unicrown fork, and it's going to use threaded inserts for the low rider pannier mounts. So, not a real difficult job, uh, but something that's kind of unique. I don't know if you've seen um, welded inserts like this before, so we're going to take a look. Uh, regardless, I've already prepped the fork legs, drilled the holes to the appropriate uh, diameter for our inserts, and now we're going to weld them in. Uh, they will be tacked in line with the fork leg on each side. Then I'll go to the lateral outside aspects, add a little bit of filler uh, for where the fork leg curves out from underneath the boss, and then we'll fuse all the way around and show you the final product. Quick little video, but a meat and potatoes kind of thing uh, that gets done in the shop every single day. So without further ado, here we go. Welding in threaded inserts into a titanium fork leg. Woo! So here we have our titanium unicrown fork leg. It's already been bent, swaged, machined up. And you can see we have one, two, and then as we rotate, a third hole for our titanium panniers. And here's what we're gonna be putting in it. This happy little titanium threaded insert. This one's courtesy of my good friend Drew over at Engine Cycles. Uh, he's making these now on his own, and I like to support my friends and their projects, so we're using some of his threaded inserts today. All right, we're gonna take our little insert and place it in our tube. You can see it's a nice fit. Not quite interference, but sits in there gently. No gaps or spaces between the tube and the insert. And you can see as we walk around this lateral side, we do have a little bit of an edge. So let's finish taping up our holes, wiping it down with acetone, and getting ready to go here. After a good purge, we're going to go ahead and get the lateral edges tacked up. Then moving to those outside edges, add a little filler. And then we're going to fuse our way all the way around, angling the torch so we have a nice meld between the insert and the fork leg. And what we have left is a nicely welded, purged, very clean looking threaded insert. Thanks a lot for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed this little tidbit of knowledge. I look for you at the next video. Take care.